So the Griffin is Bristol's dedicated heavy metal pub. There are these niche places. Not every pub does what we do, um, and we're very unique in that respect. So once COVID hit, obviously everything grinds to a halt. Being our 10th anniversary year, we had 12 months of incredible bands lined up to play here. Bigger bands that you wouldn't normally expect to, to play a 50 capacity venue, but we'd had booked them. I was still getting emails a couple of months into lockdown going, is this gig happening? It's been incredibly difficult. The scare stories that you hear from, from pub co's and, and a lot of venues with paying exorbitant rents, I've been in, always been in an incredibly fortunate position that my landlords are understanding of certain situations. And so it was incredibly encouraging that we had an open and friendly dialogue for them to appreciate that this is unprecedented uh, uh, scale of things and that they were able to, to support that. Furlough has been incredibly useful. The initial grant from the government in April, we received uh, a £10,000 grant uh, within a couple of weeks of that scheme being announced which was a major help keeping on top of things and then with the rollout of the furlough scheme that helped and allowed me to keep on the four members of staff that I have uh, full time here. They've been on on the furlough payroll ever since. I wasn't in a position to put my staff, myself uh, or any of my customers in harm's way so I held off opening from the 4th of July until October. So we were closed March to October completely. In that time, there were plenty of things for me to get on in and around the pub, a lot of renovations I've undertaken. We have seven small round tables throughout the pub. They've always been just plain boring tables. So what I wanted to do uh, was run a little competition with local artists or, or anyone who's uh, been to the pub that wanted to display their work. The public then voted on social media for their favourite designs, seven tables of seven unique pieces of art from locals uh, and, and people that are familiar with the pub. So that kind of kept my mind busy. Lockdown 2 happened. That's when you start getting back of the mind thoughts of how long is this going to keep going on for. You do start to worry about are you doing the right thing? Are you going to have a business to come back to? This is unprecedented in our lifetime, but no one really has any answers for it. There's something wonderful about heavy metal that the music kind of shares the anger for you you'll have all this pumped up emotions going on particularly over the past 12 months that been keeping to yourself if you listen to heavy music it it screams for you it lets your emotions out you can have a good head bang and enjoy yourself with that without harming anybody around you 